Hi, I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos, and I don't sell just pianos. I also sell well, lots of stuff, but right now I'm going to talk about music stands. I'm going to talk about two different kinds of music stands that I have, um, both uh, the classier living room uh, music stands as well as music stands for gigging. So let's start with, um, with, these, with these different styles. These are, uh, I, I've sold these to people that, uh, that, for example, their children play other instruments like uh, violin or, or flute or whatever and they, and they have it right next to the piano. They might have it right there. And it, of course, fully adjustable and it's all wood. These are, these are manufactured, I think, in Spain. Is that right? I don't, I don't remember. I think they are. I think it's a company out of Spain um, that does these, and they're really, really well built. Um, just very sturdy and uh, and very classy. And some are some the style is a little bit more. Um, here, let me go back. Some of the style is a little bit more masculine. I like this one. This one's a little more masculine, I think. Adjustable. And, and the angle as well. And then, and then these two are a little bit more feminine. Um, so they, they come in, uh, in mahogany and ebony, uh, gloss, satin, and then, and then we can also, we can also have them uh, have them custom stained if, if you need to. Okay, these stands um, we met the guy in uh, in California that designed these at a uh, at a music convention, um, and he he was a musician and he tried to address every issue that he had on the road as a traveling musician. And I've done a lot of, a lot of gigging around Utah and Salt Lake counties and I know that uh, there are always there are always issues with with different stands that that I've used on different gigs and these stands were clearly designed by a musician because they they do they they completely eliminate any issue that uh, that you might have with wind or with uh, falling over with portability um, some 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 stands that I've used are very sturdy um, and, and you know you can use paper clip or uh, uh, clothes pins to hold the music back, but then you've got other issues. And, and one one music stand in particular that I can think of that I've used is really bulky. Um, but these are just everything all in one. They're, they're three different sizes. Um, they fold up very easily. They can be used on. Uh, Anywhere from full height all the way to uh, tabletop. So I guess I can demonstrate that just on the floor right here. If, if that were a table, it just has that little uh, built-in thing there as for the tabletop. And for, uh, for the traveling musician, it folds up nice and easily. cheap. I, that, that's another thing. Um, when I was first starting out as a, as a gigging musician, I found a music stand at DI. Um, I think it was like 50 cents or something like that. Oh, perfect. I need a music stand. So I got it. And it lasted like, well, it, it didn't fall apart or anything like that, but I just couldn't stand using it because it was so cheap and it was like, it was like falling over and wind and all sorts of, anyway. So this just everything um, that hole there. So there is a fold it up, and then this is the shoulder strap. I won't I won't demonstrate it. There's another little hole there that it goes onto for the shoulder strap, and you've got your nice collapsed music stand. 
And then this one is a little bit um, more uh, tricked out, I guess you could say. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good description. <laughs> it has, it has for the this, really intense gigging yeah, musician. For the intense gigging <laughs> musician. Um, all of this is for uh, your music in that little uh, And that's pocket. removable too if you don't want it on there. And these little straps for wind. The wind resistors. Anyway. So... And this is the mini version. Yeah, the, this is all the for same the, features in in mini size. For the super uh, compact gigging musician. So, music stands.